Hi, my name is Dr. Erin Daniel with Rejuvenate Life Chiropractic, and today I'm giving you a virtual office tour for my open house. June 17th is a Thursday from 4 to 7 p.m., book signing 6 to 7. Books are available. I will have some here, so if it's something you cannot attend the event and you would like to, just let me know. I will also have screenings that I am doing for nervous system scans and checks to check for uh, what nerves could possibly be disturbed. That will be Saturday the 19th, so we can sign up for that. If you sign up, I will need a name, a birth date, a phone number, and an email address for you. Uh, in order to reserve your spot, there's some things I need to input into the computer system. I'm so going to give you a virtual office tour. My name is Dr. Erin Daniel with Rejuvenate Life Chiropractic. This is the reception area. Um, that the patients sit, we have a water, uh, filtered water available as well as I can always throw some coffee on. In the main area here, we share an outside door with the Edward Jones um, as well up front here. So you have to go in through the main door and then come through these doors. As you can see, we have a spot that we can um, hang up our coats or anything like that. We also have different businesses, local businesses, uh, in our card rack holder. Then we have our coffee and our water. Okay, the reception desk is up here. So um, I also have a doorbell, so if for some reason I am unavailable um, and you need something, there's always a doorbell that you have permission to ring. I will try to step out as soon as I can. Uh, in here, off of the reception area, is the adjusting room. So what is an adjusting room? An adjusting room is where we correct nervous system disturbances. Okay, so the things that can cause our nervous system to be disturbed are physical, chemical, and emotional stressors. Okay, and chiropractic is for kids and people of all ages. In every adjusting area, there is a little table. I have hair ties for people if we need to have hair ties. Uh, we also have a coat rack in every room. Okay, as far as the adjusting table, this is how we work with manual medicine. So I use a combination of my hands, um, of drop tables, and of instruments. So it's just a couple of the instruments that we might see. I have an overall adjusting tool. Okay, an adjusting tool that creates some pulses. Okay, it's a very gentle technique as well as a vibration instrument. Um, so many, many different things here. There's a sink in every room because obviously hand washing and cleanliness is important. As we come back into the reception area, we're gonna go down through a hallway. And in this hallway, we have this little turquoise door. It's usually open, okay? Down the hallway on the right is the digital x-ray room. So this is where we find out what level of degeneration people are in. So we are able to see bone spurs um, as well as if we're worried about any kind of fracture or pathology that we could see. This is a massage table. It is in the process of being set up right now that patients can, um, can also enjoy. Okay, so this gives us a good idea as far as degeneration level in a spine when we see what's going on. Across the hallway from the digital x-ray room, okay, that is the x-ray itself. Across the hallway, we have our exam room slash second adjusting room. Sorry for the speed on that, guys. Um, so that happens in here. We have computer scans uh, in the corner there where we detect disturbances in the nervous system. So 10% of our nerves carry pain, well, two to 5% carry pain, 10% are sensory. Then we are actually, those tests are checking for the motor nerves that go to muscles and the autonomic nerves that go to the automatic things in the body, like our internal organs. Okay, and as you can see here, that is a poster representing all of those internal organs. So we like to check the function of all of those nerves as well. I have a heart rate variability monitor that lets us know if we stay in a fight or flight or a rest and digest part of our nervous system. As we move down the hallway, okay, we have just a break room off to the left. 
So this is where the bathroom is. So just like we shared that front vestibule area, we share the back area as well. So there is a restroom sign, but you would not be walking directly into the restroom. That would be Edward Jones's door over there. And here is the bathroom that we use. So the bathroom is in the vestibule area in the back. Okay, so you would be able to find your way back out and then come down the hallway. Okay. So as we walk our way back from the bathroom, uh, most of the time we are in that first adjusting area, but this is where all the magic happens. This is basically where we take people anywhere where they're at health-wise and we help bring health and vitality back to their body as their body heals themselves, okay? We also have a road to wellness sign, which is a great thing to take a look at um, because a lot of people are in this caution or contentment zone where we think health is based on feeling. We don't have necessarily outward symptoms, though we might be taking Tums or other things like that. We're taking a leave all of the time, um, but we don't necessarily consider it as being unhealthy. Okay, our health is in a process of decreasing because subluxations, so anything that causes disturbance to the nervous system, physical, chemical, or emotional, it's progressive, it's relentless, and it's devastating, and it leads to poor health where we have illness and disease. So it's a slippery slope where we go from a dis-ease or a dysfunction in the body to all the way to an illness. We have to climb our way back up. Some of us start in this poor health. We have to climb our way back up. And a lot of times as people are feeling better, they get back in this contentment zone if they're out of their initial pain and they don't necessarily want to take the steps necessary to get us to optimal health. However, at optimal health, we have vitality, we have maximum body function, heightened innate intelligence, our peak performance is there, we have an empowered and successful life. Okay, so we really wanna make sure that we stay out of this contentment zone and work our way towards that optimal health. <coughs> Again, this is Dr. Erin Neal with Rejuvenate Life Chiropractic and that was our office tour. Please message me in order to get credit for the virtual tour. Um, you can let me know that the bathroom is in the vestibule in the back.